Hello students, welcome back. The question is from gate 2004 exam. This one is for two marks. Have a look at the statement. They are saying A and B are the only two stations on an Ethernet. Each has a steady queue of frames to send. Both A and B attempt to transmit a frame, collide, and A wins the first back of race. At the end of this successful transmission by A, both A and B attempt to transmit and collide. The probability that A wins the second back of race is. Okay, so I like to discuss a few points before moving on to the solution. See, in CSMA CD, if a frame is being sent, the sender will also detect the collisions. Okay, so there is a possibility that a collision occurs. In case of collision, we use the exponential back of algorithm. Suppose there is a collision between data of two stations. We'll use the exponential back of algorithm. This algorithm is used to determine for how much time both of the stations will wait before retransmitting. See, they cannot immediately retransmit. Because if both of them retransmit immediately, next time also there will be a collision. So we need different waiting times. Waiting times are determined by this algorithm. See, suppose this algorithm says A will wait for one time slot and B will wait for two time slots. In this case, what will happen? In this case, after one time slot, A will start transmitting. Okay. One time slot has passed and A has started transmitting. Okay. After two time slots, B will start transmitting. Okay. Now B will first sense the carrier. It is carrier sense multiple access. B will sense the carrier and B will see already there is data from some other channel. So B will not send. That means A has won the race because A is data is being transmitted but B has lost because B realizes already someone is sending the data okay see when after one time slot A will try to send it will first sense and it will see the channel was empty okay so this is exponential back of algorithm they are saying exponential back of algorithm is used obviously Ethernet will use CSMA CD and CSMA CD uses the exponential back of algorithm. Okay. Now I'll just like to repeat the points that are mentioned in question. In question they are saying both of the stations try to send and their frames collide. So first frame of F1, sorry, first frame of station B, that is frame number one, collides with first frame of station A. So there is a collision. It is resolved with the help of this exponential back of algorithm. In question only they are mentioning that A wins the exponential back of race. That means A will send its frame and B will wait. Okay. Now after successfully transmitting frame F1, both of the stations again try to transmit their next frames. So B will now try to transmit first frame only, but A will try to transmit its second frame. Okay. Again, there is a collision according to the question. Question says now between F1 and F2, there is a collision. Just find out what will be the collision number for this case. This frame, frame number one of station B first collided with frame number one of station A. Now it has collided with frame number two of station A. That means collision number here is two because there are two collisions of this frame. Okay. Now let us find out collision number for station A's second frame. This frame has collided only once. Okay. When the station tried to send this frame for the first time, it collided with this frame. Okay. So collision number is one. Okay, this is the only important point that you need to take care of. Please don't say collision number is equal to two. This frame has collided only once. Now the question is simple. We'll just 
चूज अ रैंडम नंबर फ्रॉम द रेंज इन थेरी लेक्चर्स आई टोल्ड यू दैट रेंज इज जीरो टू टू रेज टू दावर सी माइनस वन ओके बोथ ऑफ द स्टेशन विल चूज अ रैंडम नंबर इन दिस रेंज सो फॉर स्टेशन ए द रेंज इज जीरो टू टू रेज टू दावर वन माइनस वन दैट इज वन फॉर स्टेशन बी द रेंज विल बी जीरो टू टू रेज टू दावर टू माइनस वन दैट इज फोर माइनस वन ओके नाउ लेट अस सी व्हाट आर ऑल द पॉसिबिलिटीज सपोज ए हैज चूजन जीरो एंड बी हैज चूजन जीरो सो फर्स्ट पॉसिबिलिटी इज जीरो जीरो सेकेंड पॉसिबिलिटी इज जीरो वन देन जीरो टू जीरो थ्री The next possibility is A has chosen one. Okay, B has gone for zero. So one zero one 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 two and one three. These are all the possibilities. Now, what is the meaning of zero zero? If both of them chose zero, in this case, exponential back of algorithm says just after waiting these many time slots, start transmitting. that means after waiting for zero time immediately a will start transmitting immediately b will start transmitting that means there is a collision okay so there is a collision in this case what will happen in this case in this case a will immediately start transmitting but b will try to transmit after one time slot and when b will try to transmit first it will sense the carrier okay it will see already some frame is there on the channel so b will realize that it has lost the race okay in this case who is going to win a because a's frame will be transmitted here also a will win here also a will win in this case let us see what will happen after zero time that means immediately b will try to send a frame it will see that channel is empty so b will start transmitting and b's frame will be on channel after one time slot a will just sense the channel for transmitting and a will see that already some data is there on the channel so a will realize that it has lost the back of race okay so a's frame will not be transmitted in this case there will be a collision okay in this case a's frame will be transmitted here also a's frame will be transmitted now they were asking what is the probability that second back of race is won by a so out of total 8 cases 1 2 3 4 5 5 a will win 5 times so the probability is probability of a winning is 5 out of 8 okay this will be 0.6 something so this is your answer now have a look first time a1 okay a1 the first back of race second time probability of a winning is 0.6 that means for second time there is a high chance that a will win this is not justice actually if first time a wins it must be so that second chance must be given to b okay but this is not the case in reality if first race is won by a there is a high chance it will win the second race also and third time it's like very high probability of a winning this is called capture effect we have already discussed about this effect in a great detail in the theory lectures but still for revision let me repeat it capture effect means if a station wins first back of race there is high chance it will keep on winning the next races so it will capture this channel that means there is a high chance that entire data of the station a will be transmitted first then only the next station will get a chance when the station says i am done i don't want to transmit any more data okay 